Hello, my name is Adriana Teodora Dyer. I'm a tarot-based life consultant, and I have a message today for the Earth signs. This is for Capricorn, Taurus, and Virgo. Very strange thing happening this week. The water reading said a lot of air, or no, yeah, the water reading said a lot of Earth energy, and now the Earth readings have a lot of water energy. So I think y'all are switching places or something. Not sure what's going on there. So energy around you this week. Very good card. Ten of Cups. This is the card of fulfillment, of contentment, um, that you've been working emotionally to really achieve a sense of bliss, that something has finally come together and you're just kind of feeling good. This is just a very peaceful, serene card. And because of that, so you're feeling pretty good about it. We've got the Ace of Pentacles and you're thinking, okay, it might be time to start something new. And it might be time to grow something new. We, we finished that. Now we're going to grow something. And Pentacles are things that happen on the earth. So materials, health, I guess clothing is a material, but something about, you know, your general appearance, but your presence in a physical body. So starting something along those lines. Now, your advice is interesting because, like I said, it's got a lot of water in it. We've got the Nine of Wands going into the Hierophant, which, by the way, is the card associated with Taurus. And then we've got the Five of Cups going into the King of Cups. So this new thing that you're building, they want you to make sure that you're not building it from the wrong place. Okay, the Hierophant is a good grounded energy that thinks about everything, that understands all the facts, puts things together. And um, they do want you to be alert to that, but they want you to be alert to the fact that you need to build this new project in the direction of emotional fulfillment. So in the past, that may not have been your intent. You may have thought, okay, you know, I want to get more money out of this, or I want to get more visibility, or I want to just achieve something I haven't done before. But you weren't really thinking about relationships, and you weren't really thinking about that relationship with yourself. So now the idea is this new project, how can I make it part of the fulfilling relationship I have with myself so that I don't feel loss so that I don't feel sadness for something I've missed because sometimes you know we earth signs get so practical and we also like to bury our emotions and we forget that we need emotional support just as much as the person that cries at the drop of the hat or the person that you can read their emotions all over their face you know we need that that emotional support just as much and so this project and this new focus or new whatever you're starting this the call this time is to make sure it's emotionally satisfying, that you feel emotionally fulfilled and that you feel really, really emotionally supported. So for some of you, this is just the relationship inside of you, between you and you. But for others, it's talking about presenting this project so that it does to help build community. It gives other people a sense of belonging, a sense of support, a sense that you're there for them. And, um, you know, that's, like I said, that's for some of you. For most of you, it's the internal thing that you just make sure that this is something that makes your heart sing, that makes you feel good, and that really makes you feel nourished. Not just provided for in the material sense, but actually nourished. Okay, so really nice message for you this week. Please subscribe if you'd like to see more videos. They come out weekly. If you're ready for a reading one-on-one, -on -one, I do have some availability over Skype or Zoom. Um, we can schedule them according to your availability and mine. Very convenient. And um, you can learn more on my website. And I'll see you next week. Have a good one.